Hello everyone, this is BK2421 and I just got done listening to the new All That Remains track. This probably won't end well. And just like the ironic title states, it probably didn't end well. Um, to recap, uh, All That Remains had come out with a new track just a f uh, like a month or so ago called new No Knock. And I really enjoyed that song. I thought it was very heavy, very in your face, kind of not quite rep representation representative of what their old work did because it was more simple and just uh, just rhythm based, but it was a song that really got got me excited, hoping, oh, maybe this band has gone back to the you know the the form of uh, the fall of ideals. You know, they're they're doing more heavy stuff again, which was very was missing a lot in their last two albums, in my in my opinion. Uh, so now they have, they have released their first official single of the new album, and I've got to say I'm pretty underwhelmed, uh, mainly. It's not, mainly to the fault of Phil Abani, not 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 knocking the no knock on the uh, instrumentals of the other guys because the, the instrumentals on this song are actually pretty sweet. It's got a really cool intro that you know I haven't really heard from all the remains yet, and the the drums, the guitar, the, the the way that it was all brought out was really interesting to me, and I liked it a lot. But Phil Abani's vocals are just him just singing. The whole song is just mm, no. It's not there. It's you. you you've got a, a decent singing voice, but not something that's going to carry this band or carry the song. You really need to step up and start screaming a lot again. And that's what really made this band appealing, at least to me, when I first started hear hearing them. On uh, you know songs like "The Air That I Breathe," six, uh, you know songs like that. So, to me. This may not entirely be on All That Remains, though, because this could be the first, you know, while it's the first single on this album, and as if you know anything about music, the record labels want something that's going to sell, and this is probably the song on the album that the that the album that the record label's like, you need to make this so that this album, you know. So to me, they may be having this first single, which is clearly just supposed to be, you know, for radio purposes, uh, clearly th that may be the product of the uh, the ironic title. So maybe, maybe we'll hear more stuff like No Knock, although Phil Abani himself has said that it's not going to be, but at the same time, it may not be like stuff like this. So I think it's worth mentioning that Phil Abani himself discredited and said that, uh, his album, A War You Cannot Win, sucked, and that what they've been doing, that they're going to try and be the new pioneers or a metal or whatever he's been talking about. He's been he's been saying a lot of things that they need that metal needs a new bad guy, blah blah blah, that he'll be him. So you really need to step it up on this album there, or else uh, a lot of people are gonna be looking at you because this so far, you're one for two. Because No Knock was a good song, but this one isn't. So I'll give you a pass in terms of this may just be the for the record label, but this better be a solid album if you're gonna be talking like that. So I would give this song probably a 6.5, just an average, you know, it's okay. You know, it, it's not, it's not something that's really sticking with me. It's not gonna, I mean, I recommend that everyone listen to it at least once. They get, you know, the, the instrumentals are at least interesting, but other than that, this song doesn't really have any memorable value to it or something that's going to make you want to play it over and over again, at least in my opinion. So uh, if you have any questions, or not questions, if you have any comments, uh, if we want to talk about it, uh, get hyped up for the new album, which is supposed to be released in a month, and it is called, what was it named again? It's called The Order of Things, alright? So, and it will be available February 24th, so a little over a month from now. So, if they have any new songs come out before the album, I'll make sure to review those as well. Um, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!